going to start this fly with a size 12 nymph hook and a 1 8 bead. I'm going to use 70 denier olive string for this fly. We're going to use olive dyed, I don't think it's really wood duck, but fake wood duck. Um, we're going to use that dyed olive for the tail. Now I'm going to use this yellow, hot yellow wire. I love this stuff. It's kind of like gold. I use a lot of that gold ribbon. It's pretty nice. I get it in small. We're going to use this olive Dubbing. You can see the guide hair, guard hairs are still there in this rabbit dubbing. It's olive dyed rabbit. We're going to rib this now, right up to about where the end of the dubbing is, with that gold wire, that hot yellow wire. We're going to use some nymph skin and then we're going to tie that right in at the end of your dubbing. <coughs> oh, I almost forgot. You cut this in about a quarter inch and you got to remove the paper off the back. And make sure you tie it with the shiny side down so that when you pull it over, the shiny side's up. Now we're going to tie in these uh, medium yellow lively legs. Um, you tie it in right behind the bead and behind the front legs. Go in the first set, go in right behind the bead. Um, then you wrap in between the legs and then back behind the second set of legs and tie it down. I'll show you step by step. Hey, if you don't have any of these lively legs, 
just whatever you use for the thorax, where the legs would go, you just pick that out with a, uh, a needle or something, and instead of the legs. So you're going to cut that little tab off right in front of the front legs and then right behind the second set of legs you're going to cut the third set of legs off and that tab too. For the thorax here you're going to use this dark olive it's like dark olive gray. That's what I'm going to use. You can just use a darker olive um, in your thorax or black. Now you're going to wrap that nymph skin over and tie it down right behind the bead and then you're going to cut it close as you can. Don't cut your string, your thread, and then you just cover that up with thread wraps or leave it there, bend, wrap it back. I bend it back over top of the other nymph skin. It's cool. Hey, hope you liked that second video. This is Tuesday, and it's second day of the challenge. Hope you liked that. that. Tracy loves that fly. That's deadly olive lively legs is deadly. Now, if you don't have the lively legs, just pick out the thorax, like I said, I think, during the video. Just pick out that hair you put in the thorax area, and it, they work just as good. Okay, so... Welcome. Stay, I hope you made it. You guys tied these two so far. See you tomorrow for day three of the challenge. We'll check out the other videos. You know, above here. Keep your lines wet. Out of the trees and only give them fish a sore lip.